No, wait. Oh. Dawn of the first day. Hi, Naya. Hi. <laughs> this is how we're going to start out. Like, literally every single episode, if I continue to do this format, is going to start out with that and this. Wait, 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 wait. There we go. Literally, it's going to start out like this every single freaking time. Is me slowing time down and going, hi, Naya, right as we walk out on the dawn of the first day. So, uh, enjoying the time loop, we will, we will go ahead. So, I guess, actually, it's not just that, but I'm actually going to start out like this. Check it out. First off, this game, I think it, it it's not ported over particularly smooth to the the GameCube because I noticed a couple times it lagged already but I figure we can go ahead and run over to the first temple anyways so I do intend to 100% this game there is a very important reason why I want to 100% this game but to do that also requires a little bit of finesse in the dungeons because there is a, there is an aspect in fact I can just tell you what that aspect is the aspect that is difficult for the dungeons is that the dungeons have gathering up fairies like you saw in this town and gathering those fairies yeah that can be a challenge especially if you don't know where they're at um i will of course use everything at my disposal including my large memory bank that tells me exactly where all those fairies are at without any flaws at all naya and so I would never look it up, but I will definitely conveniently remember everything I need to. So, uh, we're going to the swamp. This song gets stuck in my head so hard. How was your Halloween? I don't want to talk about it. Don't want to talk about Halloween? No, I don't. Well, you know what? Um, I, I've been wearing a lot of Majora memorabilia for Halloween, and people seem to be pretty happy about that whenever I'm, whenever I'm spotted in my Majora shirt. Doesn't really matter. Oh, so the, this freaking guard. Look at this. This guy, every single time that I go up to him, he doesn't know about the sword. So every single time that we reset time, I have to explain to this guy I have a sword and that I'm not defenseless. Frustrating to say the least. All right. Where did I say I was going? I don't want to go over there. I didn't do anything fun for Halloween, and uh, I don't have any link merchandise. So. Well, we're gonna fix that. And good for you with your shirt, but since uh, since you don't have any Majora's Mask memorabilia, I will keep that in mind. And what since did you do for Halloween? I did everything for Halloween. Hmm. I had a great Halloween. I that I have a cat that's trying to attack my microphone right now. Okay. No, I had a good Halloween. Um, so. That said, it may not be Halloween anymore, but that doesn't mean that we can't enjoy Majora's Mask, which is absolutely a creepy game, so it fits in that Halloween aesthetic just fine. I don't think I can blow this up with my face. I like how this guy ran, though. Sorry, dude. <laughs> Whoa! Isn't that too dangerous? Yeah, well, I just wanted to double check that I'm pretty sure that I can't just use this to blow that rock up, so I had to double check, dude. Yeah, let's go this way. All right, Southern Swamp. Let's go see what's going on up here. All right, see this guy? You can already tell he's good. He's good people. He's like, blimey, where is he? That spoiled child off playing hooky again? A child his age has no business searching for fairies. Oh, <clears throat> welcome. Uh, well then, why don't you show me a pictograph you've taken? I don't have a pictograph, sir. Huh? Is it your first time entering the pictograph contest? What? Well, Fantastic name. Side quest, side quest, side quest. Nothing's normal. It's Zelda. You can't just do stuff. All right. Well, let's uh, let's do this this way. Ready? Hoppity, hoppity, hoppity. Hoppity, hoppity, hoppity. Bloop, bloop. All right. So I'm looking for a old hag with a magic shop, and I'm not looking to fight these dudes right now because I don't really. Yeah, I think this seems like it'd be it. Now I just gotta remember what's in this area. Woods of mystery. Beware of ferocious turtles. <laughs> you mean snapping turtles? 
Yeah, I've heard of those before. Well, I mean, it can't be any worse than the Lost Woods. Have you ever... I don't, uh, I don't remember this music being in this forest. Have you ever... I don't know if I should ask if you even held a... That reminds me of like a baby... This is just or something. This is literally exactly. I don't remember this part uh, as well as I remember that there was a forest. Hey, look, it's a turtle. But uh, I forgot that this was like exactly like it was in, uh, in Oca Ocarina of Time. Ferocious turtle. Dodge the ferocious turtle. Have you ever seen a snapping turtle? Oh, ow, ow, help me. Oh, you found her. Remember, so to support your idea that uh, we're in hell, remember we killed her in the last game? Yeah. Like, she's dead. Yet here we are. I was just minding my own business, picking mushrooms, when bam, I got hit from behind. <laughs> that pesky skull kid, did he think an old hag wouldn't recognize him if he had hit his face? <laughs> oh, ow, to think he's yeah. that powerful, and now I can't even move. You, don't you have anything that gives you energy? Uh, yeah, sure, here's a bomb. That gives me a life. <laughs> you're no help. I say, you're not You're not at all what you make yourself out to be. <laughs> well, now I remember uh, the woods of mystery. I forgot they were exactly like the Lost Woods. So, uh, well, let's make a potion. Um, double bubble toil and trouble, here we go. I don't know why <laughs> I did that. I can just go forward. Um, yeah, to, so to support your your idea that Link is in hell is we're seeing all the characters. Even though they're not exactly the same characters from the last game, they're still the same textures. And while we know from a programming standpoint why they would do something like that, the idea is he's seeing all the characters. That, I mean, look, see? this the two of them. We killed them in the last game. Although, I guess, technically, we didn't kill them because... Yeah, we never fought them because we did that in the adult timeline. This is the kid timeline, so officially, yeah, I guess, you know, they, they could be alive. What? That Skull Kid's got Comey? That's ridiculous. If that if it's just <laughs> Skull Kid, then uh, what harm could he possibly do? <laughs> well, if that's true, then take this potion to her. <laughs> Cat's getting a little playful, <laughs> and he's attacking my leg instead of my hand that's tapping his foot. <laughs> Alright, one more time. Let's heal the evil witch that I will go on to murder later on in life. Don't feel obligated to help a old hag when you see one? Uh, yeah, let me just, uh, let me go ahead and I got the glass bottle now, so let's go ahead. I don't need that blast mask. Uh, here, go ahead and uh, drink up. And, you know, all you're going to do with this is Katake gave you a potion, I give you your potion, then you're going to try to kill me later on in life. But <laughs> since this is the childhood timeline, we, maybe maybe this is the point where uh, Kumi is going to feel nice and happy and uh, change her life for the better. You I saved really me. Gonna happen? I'm the swamp tour guide. I run the boat cruise. So come by if you want a free ride. I can't wait to kill you someday. All right, well, uh, out of the forest, Naya. This is, I was gonna say, do you remember, but then the thing that I'm asking you to remember is something that happens in this game. Thanks for what you did back there. In a special deal for you, I'll let you face or take this cruise for free. Ah, yes, we've got a special going on right now, so we're giving this someone out for free. So here's a random box to take pictures in, Naya, and if you take a nice picture from the boat, take it to that fella over there. All right, the boat's leaving. Now, are you ready to take an extreme challenge? Welcome to the boat cruise. Oh, Please. it's like the Pokemon Stadium. Uh, how do you figure that? Because you're on a thing that's moving. You have no control over that, and you're taking pictures. Well, let's uh, let's start with this. Is that not like you can't control the boat? It's uh, literally... You said Pokemon Stadium. You mean Pokemon Snap. Oh. Did yeah. I say a stadium? I'm sorry. Snap. And that's exactly what this is. <laughs> well, like, when you said no, I was like, what do you mean? That's exactly what it is. It even says snap. I wonder what came first, this or Pokemon Snap? 
kind of want to look it up, actually. All right, well, we're going to get a nice picture of uh, Big Octo right here. Ooh. That was well, great. Yeah, that was... Oh, my God. Damn it. Well, guess I'm not getting a picture of that guy. He's dead. All right, well, that's fine. What do you think of this? Pokemon Snap 1999. This game was 2000, I think, so Snap was first. Uh, I'll take a picture of a monkey. Yeah, Majora's Mask was 2000. Well, I guess I didn't get any good pictures. The I'll swamp water pictures. is poisonous. All right, let's go. All right. Um, so, yeah, there's nothing we can do about the swamp water situation, and I can't go over there and do anything about that big octo. So, let's talk to the monkey. Welcome to Deku Palace. Hmm. Drop that beat. <laughs> Alright. Um, so the first thing you'll learn is... They're going to say this. You have to be a Deku? This is Royal Palace of Deku Kingdom. This is no place for outsiders. Alright, one thing I do want to know is... I should just go in first, but... Alright, let me in. This is the palace of the kingdom. Only those on official business may enter. But you may enter to see the public humiliation of the foolish monkey who angered our king. Follow this hall straight to the royal chamber. Do not enter any other areas whatsoever. Oh, that's awful trusting of them. Alright, so don't enter any areas that they told me not to enter. No problem. Check out all the money that they just leave laying around. Whoa. Oopsie. You got trouble. You got in trouble. You got caught. Yeah, here's what's funny about it. They don't they seem let to... you back in? Yeah, they oh don't care. They <laughs> let you back in? They let anybody in these days. Well, actually, we probably should just go straight ahead because I can cut out all of the miscreants that have evolved around... Or revolve, happen to revolve around doing that. Um, yeah, I was gonna say I can't jump into this fire if I recall. All right. Well, let's see what the what the big let's see what the king has to say. Only royal family members can enter the sunken temple, so it's obvious the monkey was using her. All right. Well, how about Jeeves here? What do you get? Jeeves. Now that our beloved princess is missing, the king has been unable to keep his cool. I fear the princess may be caught up in some kind of trouble, just as that monkey claims. But in his current state, the king can't even send troops out to look for her. What are we to do? Hey, king, what do you got going on, man? Well, that's... Yeah, this guy can party. I haven't seen your face before. Are you visiting? Usually, I don't allow the likes of you into my royal chamber, but today is different. We're about to punish the foolish monkey who kidnapped the Deku princess. He has insulted the royal family. I'll show him what happens when you do that. That foolish monkey is up there in that cage. Take a look at his face. I... Oh, he's, he's up here. There's the monkey. No. Well, let's see what he's got. They keep saying that I kidnapped her. No matter how many times I say it, it's not going to bring the princess back. If they're not careful, the princess will fall victim to a monster. Please believe my words. Well, can't shoot him. Alright, well, let's uh, let's snoop around, why don't we? Snoop, snoop. Snoop, snoop. You're gonna get caught again, I know it. I am not. No, I know it. Oh, there's the monkey. Was my brother alright? Yeah, sort of. Did, uh, did you see the entrance to his cage? We know a secret route there. Enter the secret route from the outer garden entrance. The entrance is in a tall place. Nobody can reach it. You need bean from the bean cellar. Lie or live, sorry, beneath the uh, palace garden. Yeah, I understand you. Okay, you smart. <laughs> Plant bean in soft place outer garden. You figure out rest. Hurry, help brother. All right, well, which one's the outer garden and which one's the other place? All right, so here's my hole. And there should be a guy that I can get some magic stuff from. Some magic plants. 
but he's not here. Please feel free to take our fresh spring water. Well, I mean, I'm all about planning ahead, even though I don't quite remember what this is for. Might as well grab some spring water. Mine's all black. It's fine. It's just, it, it, it's for this. So I don't have the magic beans. Wait a minute, hold on. Is the bean guy, yeah, he's up here, isn't he? Hey guy, I need some magic plants. Well, chomp, chomp, chomp. You're the first customer I've had in a long <laughs> time. Do you need some magic beans? Yeah, dude, I need some of that magic. Uh, uh, I'll give you one free sample. You see, and then you'll be hooked and you'll come back. Alright, I think this is where I want to go. In fact, I am absolutely correct. Check it out. Beans! And some water, which I would be so incredibly angry if I freaking missed. Weird black water. It's not black water, it's just good old, nice, refreshing, drinkable water. I wouldn't drink it. You no would be missing out. Alright, well, let's do this, because I don't have all day, man. All this nice stuff that's going on right now, at the end of the day, I still have a timer. Got some magic to restore my snot bubbles, and... Alright, we're crossing over to the other one, so here we go. Alright, let's go ahead and get down to this guy right here. Got him? Hey, look at that. I am just on it today. Alright, ready? Yes. Oh my god, what happened? Uh, what did happen? What happened? Naya! Whee! Oh! I am such a beast! <laughs> I saved it. The only issue is now the camera angle is all messed up. Oh my god, this camera angle. What have I done? Jesus. I broke the game. Uh, I feel like that was impressive enough. I'll leave that in. All right. Check it out, we broke into the Deku Chamber. They keep saying I kidnapped her. Well, yeah, that's, uh... Okay, well, let's, I guess, get you down from there, buddy. Oh, you! How did you get in here? Shh, if they see you, they'll capture you. Oh. What? My brother asked you to help? Uh, I'm terribly sorry. Just try to cut my rope. We'll talk after that. Alright, here we go. No good after all. Wait, you don't happen to have something that can make you a lot of noise, like an instrument uh, that <laughs> carries... <laughs> if you have one, show it to me. Uh, well, I'm assuming that you want this. That is not the correct thing to do. All right, I don't need beans anymore. Here's a giant pipe I keep in my pocket. Oh, you do have them. Uh, Deku pipes, that'll work great. By the way, who are you? Whoa, that's not important. Just listen to me. I was trying to find out about the poison in the swamp, so I went to the Woodfall Temple above the waterfall. But the temple had become a monster's lair, and the princess was captured by that monster. Mm. Uh, since the Deku King thinks I kidnapped the princess, he won't listen to a word I say. Now the princess is in trouble, so I must somehow hurry to the temple and save her. Do you understand my plight? Yes. Just like the owl, remember? Do you understand? Do you understand? So then that means... You will go in my place and save the princess. Uh, sure, bro. <laughs> okay, now I'll teach you the melody that opens the temple. The princess taught it to me. We can't let us hear, so I'll sing it softly. Let's hear that beautiful voice. Alright, well, uh... 
How about we just play this tune for the king? Let's try again. If you recall, this is what the scarecrow theme I made last game. Uh, now you know where it's from. The Sonata of Awakening. Hold on yourself, though. Look, everybody's so happy. I've brought peace to the kingdom. Naya, isn't that great? Oh, God. <laughs> See, look at that. Music brings peace. Everybody's peaceful now. This melody awakens those who have fallen into a, fallen into a deep sleep. Everyone, did you hear that? This melody, which only the Deku royal family knows, it proves the foolish monkey deceived the princess so he could enter the temple. <laughs> Everyone, let's let the mon monkey's punishment commence. Well, first they uh, they beat me down. You better take the shortcut. But you must hurry. If you don't, I will be punished by the Deku King. You don't suppose that after something like that, they would still let me in, do you? No. I told you not to enter any areas other than the royal chamber. It is a very rare occasion. Well, look at that. Oh, no way. <laughs> I'll just walk in and uh, let's go see how... How do you think the monkey's doing? Oh, uh, not good. <laughs> well, I'm sure he's better than he looks. It's... Uh, oh. Uh, he's getting boiled alive. Oh, Jesus. Uh, he might be dead. Hot, hot, stop it, please. Aww. They keep saying that I kidnapped her. No matter how many times I say it, it's not going to bring the princess back. Oh, that's morbid. And you're supposed to hurriedly go and get the princess and come back. Oh. Uh, yeah, he, he just burned her death. All right, for now, let's, uh, let's head over here and let's go check out what's going on at the Southern Temple. Oh, dear lord. I forgot about those things. I don't have any Deku nuts, so I'm just going to have to fly by the seat of my pants here. Gotcha. Don't knock me out of the air. Don't knock me out of the air. Oh, three, four, and drown. All right, well, uh... Oh, crap. Of course, you're an electric mosquito. I was going to say, I can take him out as long as I do that. Pow. All right. Here we go. All right, now are you ready? Let's go. Who else could it be other than? Bow, 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 bow. bow, bow, bow. bow. This is a rare sight. You are a fairy child, correct? What business have you in this poison swamp? Wait, he doesn't remember us? No, I'm a Deku. He doesn't know oh, it's me. Oh, that's right. Okay. If you dare say, not venture further, I shall pass no judgment. It is better that you hurry back to town. This swamp you are in has lost its guardian deity, but it was destined to fade anyways. Hoot hoot. And that destiny is not solely limited to this swamp. If you have the courage... To determine or and determination to proceed in the face of destiny, then I shall teach you something useful. Before coming here, you had not seen any of the stone statues that bear close resemblance to me. I, I I did. I have placed those throughout the land to aid the one with the power to change the destiny of this land, wherever he may appear. If you have left proof of our encounter on any of those stone statues, then the song carved at my feet will certainly be of assistance. Remember it well and play it wherever it arises. From the first time you play this song, we shall become eternal friends transcending time and place. Which is already proven true because he knew when I was in the past and then I came back to the future and, you know, he knew me. But, hey, wait, wait! 
Get back here. Kapoor Gaboro. Wait. Let's be friends. All right. Well, let's... Uh... Notes are carved in the stone. Here we go. But that was the right note. Yeah. How did how did I uh, how did I get the wrong note here? Uh, oh, sorry. Dang it, the C stick. I'm telling you. You got to go super slow because if you go too fast, it doesn't register the input. That's what happened the first time. The Song of Soaring. All right, you learn the Song of Soaring. This melody swoops you up and sends you soaring to a stone bird statue in an instant. All right. Well, that happens to be how we fast travel. Whoa, don't fall down there. Falling down there right now would be a pain. Later is no problem. Right now, don't fall down there. Whoa. Well, doesn't that just look lovely? Looks like a barrel of monkeys, get it? Ha ha ha, barrel <laughs> of monkeys. Alright, let's do this. Ready? I hit the wrong one. All right, Naya. Ready to awaken the temple? Or do you want to awaken my cat? He, he's not sleeping, by the way, everybody. He's staring at his brother. And his brother is in the doorway playing with his mouse. A little crinkle mouse. All right, well, what do you think? No, I don't have enough footage for a whole episode. I was going to say, we're, we're going in the temple. All right, you ready to go in the temple? Yes. I'm going to make it. I'm going to make it. I barely made it. At first, I was like, you know what? Maybe maybe halfway through the temple, we'll, uh, we'll call it. It's up to you. All right, so I think, yeah, we're, we're going to learn a little lesson right here. Might as well grab that fairy since I already have one. Um, all right, see that? You found a stray fairy. This is your first one. So that's kind of, that's how this is going to go. Oh, whoopsie. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Stab him, just stab. I don't know what I'm even fighting anymore. Pink fairies? Yeah. I'll tolerate the pink. All right, well, I'm going to bypass them and just go straight to the... That stench! This place stinks like that poison swamp. I was going to say, I can take that thing. Oh, hey, the, look, I got a Master Sword. I don't know if that glitch carried through from the first game to this one, where a Master Sword and a Deku Stick have the same strength. I never looked it up. Double hit. Hey, look, that was weird. I don't hey, remember. I don't remember fairies being in the uh, in the enemies. I just know that you want to break all the pots, and you know you, you never know when you're gonna find a stray fairy like that. I have memories, Naya. Stray fairy. All right. Ah, crap. Uh, oh, that's right. Uh, isn't there a way to cheese this, though? Of course you would ask. Yeah. Yeah, like that. Dang it. Take the mask off. I was going to say, you absolutely can cheese this. So what you're supposed to do, Naya, is you're supposed to use... Yeah, actually, I'll just show you. For the sake of uh, letting you have the authentic experience. You're supposed to do this, okay? Go down in the flower. He goes over me. Pow. Uh. But. And actually that. You know what? Since that kills him. That is easier. But I like doing that instead. 
so I didn't actually cheese it. I made it more difficult, but it was funner that way. <laughs> I am fast tracking this because it is still the only the first day. All right. Well, uh, I would assume this is the map unless I yeah, this has to be the map. I didn't go out of order. There you go. Dungeon map with a little bit of lag to boot. All right. Here, a little speed run. All right, in we go. All right, so I happen to already know that down there is a... Actually, wait a minute. Can I cheese this? I think I can cheese this if I do it right. Yeah, see? Check it out, cheesed. This looks pretty light. Well, yeah, just hang on a sec. In fact, yeah, go ahead and push. Whoosh. It's if you use your sword, you can save the stick, see? Mm. And now I don't have to worry about doing that again. I got two fairies here. Pretty sure that's, uh, well, looks like I need that stick after all. I should just go through that door, but I'm kind of curious. All right, what did that do? I see what that did. It allowed me to do this awesome freaking jump. That's amazing, huh? <laughs> you see that little backflip thing? No, I missed it. Can you do it again? Nope. <laughs> Couple more sticks. You don't have sticks. faith in yourself now, do you? You don't think you could do that again? Uh, well, let's see. Be careful. I sense a lot of evil here. Wait. I was gonna say, that's not what I wanted to do at all. I blew my face up, and that was an accident. I'm gonna fall into so many sailor's words. All of this was really just me getting distracted, but I'm sure it was worth it. Let's see what we got. Key? Ah, oh, stray fairy. All right, so this should be that door right there. And this takes me... I got distracted. I got distracted really badly. But that's all right, because... I did. I thought I was going to kill him. All right, run. I don't know where this is going to take me. I got distracted, and this whole thing's been like a side quest, because I was supposed to go back to that one room, and I never did. Yeah, Tattle, you don't have to tell me. I know that uh, I'm heavy enough that I can do this. Well, that was interesting, wasn't it? That was a very interesting noise. Yeah, it was just ladders appearing. All right, so... Chances are, knowing me, I accidentally skipped the compass in that room that I was supposed to go to, the one that I lit the candle to... Uh-oh. Alright, well, we've got ourselves a little Zolfos who breathes fire. Alright, well, you know what? How do you feel about getting hit in the face with a Master Sword? Yeah! Oh, jeez. Yeah, look at that. It does. I took him out in three hits. That definitely has the strength of a Master Sword. They never removed it when they removed the programming or when they changed the programming over to the new game. They definitely left in the power of a Deku Stick is still that of a Master Sword. Oops. Even though, spoiler alert, there's no Master Sword in this game. Because there can't be. Okay, so, no compass, but I got the hero's bow. Check it out, Naya. We're moving right along, aren't we? Slowly but surely. In the last game, I had to have a... I, I needed to become an adult in order to use this bow, but now... No adulthood necessary. Well, that's helpful. So, check it out. I may not know where I'm going. 
but I know that there's a room in here. Uh, hello. I'm like a toxic frog. Check it out. He only took two hits. It took nothing at all. Toxic frog. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say, give me my. No, not that. Give me my bomb mask. Ow. There's a right way to do this and a wrong way to do it. <laughs> I was gonna say, where is he? I thought I, I, I thought I could give him some Z targeting. There we go. Cheese in it. Here we go. <laughs> nice. All right, I just gotta find him and then I can Z target him. There we go. Oh crap, I thought I could... Well, I guess I gotta do this the right way now, because... Oh crap, that... Alright, you know what, Naya? Forget the right way. We're gonna do this my way. <laughs> Separate him once again. Oh crap, I unz targeted him. Now I gotta go find him again. And I killed a frog. I should feel very accomplished about myself. But that's alright. A After the Skull Kid's creepy magic is gone, he's just a little frog now. He's good now. He's good people. Alright, so Naya, I have gone out of order. As you'll note, no compass, but I found the key. So boss key, good. Compass, not good. <laughs> nice! Alright, calling it right now. Boom fairy. Yeah, what do you think of that? Okay, fairy! I probably should make sure I use my impeccable memory to get all the fairies before we actually proceed to the final boss room, but uh, in the meantime, let's wipe out some of these enemies here. So let's start out with the fairy. Pop the fairy, there we go. And then I'll go get that fairy whenever I get a chance. Alright. There's a heart. Fairy? All right. Naya, I would like you to meet the first boss. Well, hold on. First. Oh, never mind. There is no. Hold on. Is it a giant turtle? This is the deity. That is not a giant turtle. Masked jungle warrior Adalwa. I don't know why. I didn't think it was going to be a warrior. I thought it was going to be a giant turtle. Very interesting sound effect music. Kinda he is a... Uh, he yo -yo going on. He is a certified deity. He's a deity that was going to fall into despair anyway. There's nothing we could do to save him. Ow, God, he just ran into me. I was going to say he just punk kicked you across the room. I wonder what kind of noise the guy made to have this recording go over and over and over. Yeah! You think I don't remember how to fight you? Easy. Ow. Oh, here he goes. He's going crazy. I think he was already going crazy. He's calling uh, swarms of locusts and... and everything that is indicative of hell in this world. Oh boy. That noise is something else. Okay. Where? I was gonna say, how many more? Oh god. 
Yeah, you're you're just you're giving me all the hearts that it takes me to do this, but I appreciate the locusts and all that and the very biblical feeling stuff, but he is actually very vulnerable. He never uses his shield except to attack. Well, I guess it doesn't have time to All right. There we go. The blast mask is such a Oh, he set him on fire. I don't remember. When did you get fire? I don't remember you having the fire. I know this game pretty well, and I don't remember you having fire. I remember the chanting, but I don't remember the fire. Oh, crap. Okay, hang on. Give me my mask. Give me my mask. There we go. Okay. A doll wolf. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I remember the spin attack. Oh, I am on fire. I am not okay, Naya. Yeah, give me that. All right. Out of curiosity, what does a doll was thing? Look closely. Those bugs seem to gather around fire. Yeah, I got you on that one, title. I'm trying to fight fight a fallen deity here. I think he jumped. Yeah, I would say he's not getting up from that. Goodbye, Adalwa. It was a pleasure, and I'm I'm sorry that I killed him so fast. You didn't get to enjoy all his wacky sound effects. I'm actually kind of glad you killed him pretty quickly because it was getting annoying, annoyingly on my nerves. Well, here's a heart container, so we have six hearts. Out of curiosity, I've never ever tried this. Can I actually walk out the? No, you can't. I was gonna say, can I walk out the door even though I killed him? All right. Well, let's uh, let's go ahead and grab this mask. You've seized Adalwa's remains. If you'll note, I cut the mask off of again. The deity. Yeah, he's uh, he's dead. You have just <sighs> freed the innocent spirit that this dark dark mask kept imprisoned within the body of the evil Adalwa. Good job. It sounds like a casino, a Dalwa casino. <laughs> oh, that's right. How could I forget this part? So you've seen this a hundred times during Smash Bros, but I don't think you were paying attention. We're going to meet a friend. What's that? Is it a Pona? <laughs> it is not a Pona. That's the only friend I know of the game. Is it Pona? Pona's my friend. It's a giant face with no body, no torso. That is not a friend. All he's got are legs and arms. That is not a friend. That is not a friend. That is not a friend. He's a friend. That's... Wait, listen. It seems to be saying something. Could that crying be its way of teaching us some, oh, some sort of melody? Don't just stand there. Get your instrument. Could this be the song? You know, if you had to piece that together yourself, that he was teaching you a song, how many people do you think would actually figure this out? I feel like a lot of people would not. Well, I personally would be afraid of whatever the heck is speaking to me at the moment. Especially because it's so tall. As a matter of fact, they are friends. You friend learned the oath to order. Friend is Epona, not whatever this thing is. He taught me the oath to order. Only friends teach you a song <laughs> like that. <laughs> I suppose. You learned the oath to order. He's saying bye bye. Sounds like a lawnmower trying to. No, it does, it's not a lawnmower. It's like a dirt bike off in the distance. T <laughs> Turns out the thing that stopped Majora was uh, was a redneck on a on a dirt bike. Rub rub rub. <laughs> Call us. That's what it's saying. <laughs> He's speaking in giant. I don't understand. No, uh, no. Uh... 
I don't know. I was trying to be clever, right. but I got nothing. As you will note, the water levels have lowered and the uh, the poison is gone. So look what we did. We did something here today. The very underwhelming temple that uh, exists here. I wonder where that fairy was that I was missing. I bet it was down in the darkness. The four people tail talked about. Do you think he was talking about the spirit that was sealed inside that mask? Oh, hey, you were pretty good out there. Have you done this before or what? <laughs> now, just keep up that pace and we can save the other three. Hey, um, what do you got, Tattle? All that stuff I did to you, your horse, I apologize. Sorry. Do you forgive Tattle? No. There, I apologize, so don't hold it against me, got it? Okay. Now then, we've helped the princess just like the monkey asked. So now our next step is the mountains. Let's hurry and do something about that skull kid. But wait a minute. What could that be, Naya? <laughs> Nothing good. Well, let's go in here and see. Is that the Deku princess? It is. Oh. Okay, I guess it is good. What? Who are you? Link, pleased to meet you. I am the Deku princess. Were you by chance asked by that monkey to come save me? Aha, just as I suspected. You see, your body smells a little bit like monkey. What are you trying to say? What does she smell? Where's her nose? Some people would find that offensive. So, the monkey made it back fine after all. That's good. I'm not trying to offend anybody. I'm just asking how Not you. I was talking about her. How'd she smell? I was worried that when I didn't come home, my father would think that monkey had kidnapped me. I was worried that my father would even go as far as to punish that poor monkey. It boiled in oil. <laughs> Don't tell me. Are you serious? Is father actually doing that? <laughs> Yet another hasty decision, father. And blow a gasket. Well, we haven't got any time to lose. Quickly, Mr. Link, could you find a way to carry me into that Deku Palace? Well, now we have to carry it? What's wrong with her legs? Seems fine to me. Well, as you'll note, it's very hard to get her over to where we're going. Unless, of course, you have some way to carry her. All right, get rid of that useless fairy. We don't need that thing. All right, see her? Yep. Just stuff her in a bottle. <laughs> you put the Deku Princess in the bottle. It's a tight fit, but she says she'll be fine. <laughs> uh, there's no time to lose. Hurry, take me to that palace. Uh, I mean, it's like a bag of holding with this one. The, the infinite density of the bottle. You pop the cork and... Suddenly, you can carry a palace in there. All right, so... Trying to decide... You know what? I'm going to pause it and do some magic. All right, so... What are we doing here? Ye who hold my remains. Return to the appointed place to face me. Oh, that's right. Okay. Yeah. So, see? You can skip the whole temple and just go straight to him. Oh, I was like, what does that mean? There's a really good reason why you would want to do this. Think of it this way. We're on a clock, right? I got three days before the world is destroyed. Yeah. If I already hold Adalwa's remains, that means if I ever come back here, I don't have to go through the temple. I can just go straight to him, fight him, and kill him, and then free the whole place. Mm. I don't have to do anything other than just go straight to him, fight him, and be done. Why do you have to do it multiple times, though? Because every single time I back time up... Oh, yeah, okay, okay. Never mind, that was a dumb question, sorry. Alright, so... I thought you got something out of it either... Every, uh, yeah. No, it's just that I would have to... If there's anything I have to do that involves this temple being purged, then I want to do it. So using my impeccable memory, <laughs> I came up with the solution here. Do you see this nest? 
Yeah. Ta-da. Found a stray fairy. This is my 14th. Crap. There's still one missing, but I'll use my impeccable memory to find it. <laughs> All right, Naya, using my impeccable memory. Check it out. Good job. <laughs> Ta-da. All right, fairy, stop running away. Let's go. You found all of them. Quick, take them to the fairy of the same color. Well, as soon as I remember how the hell to do that. All right, let's let's uh, time travel here. Let's go back to the King Deku. Hiccups. All right. Uh, even though I'm in the southern swamp in an area I didn't really want to be, but that doesn't matter. Naya, any last thoughts here? I got nothing. It's uh, it's past midnight, so I think we're gonna call it, and we'll do the Deku Princess next episode. Sounds good. Alrighty. Uh, that's it. That's all I got. Bye. See you next time.